for you to increase your watch hour on YouTube, you need to start going live now. Now, going live on YouTube helps you to increase your watch time very fast. Now, if maybe you don't want to show your face on the live streaming or you don't have the time to even do this live streaming, there is another alternative for you, which is going silent live. Now, in this video, I'm going to show you how you can do this silent live streaming using an already recorded video with an app called the Prism Live. Now, for you to do this silent live stream, you need to record the content that you want to live stream. If it's yourself, you want to talk about something, you need to record that content. Or if you have some other things that you need to record, you can go ahead and record it. And when that is done, you are going to use that video to go live. So in this tutorial, I'm going to show you how you can go live using the Prism Live. If you are not subscribed to this channel already, please go ahead and subscribe to this channel, like this video, and also share it to someone who could be in need of it. So without wasting much of your time, I'm going to be showing you how you can go live using the Prism Live app. Okay, so the first thing you need to do is to go to your Play Store or your App Store and search for Prism Live Studio. Now, when that is done, you're going to open, you are going to install the app. I've already installed mine, so I'm just going to open the app. Now, it brings you here. And when you get here, you're going to log in to your account. So meanwhile, you're going to log in with your YouTube channel account because that is the account that you're going to use to go live. So for me, I always go using, I always use the um, Google account. You go to Google accounts. When you click on Google accounts, and you're going to choose the account that you're going to use to go live. Okay. So I, when you click on that account, and when that's done, you're going to close. Now, here we are. Now, this is the account that I'm going to use to go live. So, from here, you are going to click on VTuber. Now, here we are. When you click on VTuber, you are going to click on the avatar. So, when you click on the avatar, you are going to use this little box right here to minimize the size of your avatar and place it at the middle. Now, when that is done, now you are going to swipe left. You are going to swipe left of your phone now. You can see that... Um, this place is connect, this place is live, this is video, this is photo. You can actually upload your video through Prism Live. You can also, also upload your photo through Prism Live. Now, if you are a new YouTuber and um, you have not gotten to the stage where you can go live from your YouTube, you can actually go live through this Prism Live. If you, even if you have not met the requirements of going live on YouTube, through this Prism Live, you'll be able to go live as a beginner, as a new YouTuber. So then the next thing, you're going to swipe left and then you're going to upload the content that you want to live stream. Now, it's either you go to your media, which where you already have your recorded video that you want to use to go live. Or if it's a playlist that you have, you can click there and then upload your playlist into the platform. So, but for this tutorial, I'm using the media. When you click, when you click on media, it will bring video and photo. You click on video and photo. So here you are going to click on the the video that you have recorded the video that you want to use to go live you're going to click on it here and then open that video that you want to use to go live okay so i can just go ahead and choose any video from here i'm choosing this game that i've already played and then when you click on that um video you click done and click done when that is done then now you are going to it's, it has you have uploaded it to the prison live platform and now you're going to click on on this um, video that you have brought in. So what you need to do is to um, make this video that you have uploaded to um, full screen, you are going to click here. You are going to click this very point here. You are going to click it and then it fills your screen. You can also well use your hand to adjust the size. If you want it to cover the full screen, you can increase, you can reduce it depending on the size you want and you can also increase it. But what I do most of the time, what I like, I like my um i like it when it covers the whole screen i like when the video covers the whole screen now you have successfully brought the video now this is the video this is the video that i'm going to i'm using to go live now this video is just um i think it's an eight minute video now you want to go live with this video and you want to go live for like an hour using this as this same video what you need to do is to place this video on loop so that by the time it's it finished playing the eight minute uh, duration it will start all over again by itself instead of you coming back to monitor it and 
play, pressing play again no you don't have to do all of that this app is going to help you do that it's going to be placed on loop so now how do you place this video on loop now you come to this point here this is your loop this is the loop icon now you're going to click on it when you click on it you see it has selected so when this video finished playing the first eight minutes it's going to restart by itself so it can play like that on and on for an hour for two hours for three hours to just keep repeating itself so you don't have to come back to monitor the live stream now when this is done you are going to mute your um your live stream such that muting your live stream um is very good in such a way that when you go live and you mute your live stream whatever happens around your background nobody's going to hear it only the media of your video is what is going to be heard so you can as well be doing other things at home or wherever you are while you're live and nobody will hear the background um, sound only the media of the video is what is going to be heard but if you don't mute your live stream as you are on live whatever happens around you whatever happens around where your device is whatever noise comes from there is going to enter your life and anybody that is on your live will hear all what is happening behind the scene so you don't want that happening so all you need to do is to mute your mic now for you to mute your mic you are going to come this way click on when you click on your screen you'll come to these three dots right here this very one here you're going to click on it and click on these three dots now you're going to see mic on now your mic is on you're going to turn your mic off when you click on it your mic goes off so nobody will be able to hear whatever is happening at the back background of your video with this you have gone through some steps now we are going to set up our description our title and our title so now while you're here now you can come to screen this is camera this camera means you want to go live directly not uploading a video if you want to go live directly that is when you click on the screen so you can see now i clicked on camera and i'm showing you here so if i want to go live directly you can choose that camera icon but if i don't want to go live directly i just click on vtuber that's for uh the silent live then you're going to also modify your screen type so now for the screen type you're going to click on screen you're going to click on your screen so you have a different um ratio so you can use the horizontal or the vertical um screen type for this video we are using this particular one the next thing we need to do is to click on ready now we have done the first setup so you are going to click on ready when you click on ready it's going to bring you here then you are going to click on youtube you are going live on youtube if for example you have multiple platforms like facebook and instagram you can connect all your accounts on this very platform so by the time you go live you can go live on all three social media accounts at the same time so this is one sweet um use of prison live so you can connect your facebook account if you have a facebook account you can connect your instagram and you can connect your switch you can see these are different platforms that you can connect on this live so you can connect your different account on this very um app so but i'm only going to use the youtube i click on youtube now it says connect youtube you click on connect youtube so when you click on connect YouTube, it's going to ask you to choose an account so i'm choosing the first account that's my account there so now you are going to input your password so when you are done imputing your password and then you click on continue you scroll and then click on continue again make sure to read your policies now your your youtube channel has been connected to the prism live app so when you get to this point we are going to do some setup from here you need to name uh let's give the title to your video the setup the description and so much more the resolution this is where you are going to be setting them up so you're just going to click on this transparent box here now you see live streaming of game zone this is the name of the channel live streaming of game zone below that this is the name of the channel so what you are going to do is to just erase what has been written there and then type your own title here okay now i'm going live with the game candy crush i can just say candy candy crush live game okay and then you go to your description whatever it is you need to write in your description about that video here is where you're going to do all of that so when that is done i can also write live stream of candy crush and when that is done then you're going to click on save you're going to click on save here and save now 
you have saved that of your description and then now you come here you see schedule now if you don't want to go do the silent live immediately this is where you're going to schedule your silent live you're going to create a new schedule and set the time and the date and everything so for that as for that if you don't want the live to be um public this is where you're going to set it you're going to click either public or listed or private depends on you is your choice so not for kids you need to set whether or not your content is made for kids so i'm setting it that it's not made for kids and then category you're going to come to category now this category you're going to click on it this category is um basically telling you where your video is what category is your video what category is the video you are going live with now we have theme and animation if it's an animation video an animation tutorial you're going to click there if it's autos music and all of that now you see gaming gaming is here so because i'm doing gaming live i just click on gaming click on the box here and you select that box so when that box is selected and then you go back and now stream latency how you want it to be if it's ultra low normal latency you can just go ahead and do that standard youtube license yes that one you don't have to change anything there so now we are done setting up our, our live and then when all of this is done you are done setting you're going to also upload your thumbnail you need to upload your thumbnail you click and then upload the thumbnail that you have already created okay i'm just going to choose any thumbnail here let me use this okay since i'm just doing live game when you when this is done when you upload your thumbnail you're going to click done right here click done so now you can see that our thumbnail is here when all of this setup is done i'm going to click save and we're good to go then you're going to also come here i'm going to come here click on it now you're going to choose the resolution of your video the quality of your video so i usually go for um the highest quality and then video okay yes bitrate the frame size and all of that you need you don't need to change any of those ones so when that is done you just click on your screen and everything so now you can see before it was 720 but now it has changed and um for schedule this is where you can schedule this right here is where you can schedule your live when you click on it the calendar is going to come up for you to schedule okay so that's for that and when all of these are done let me commute our mic again when all of these are done fully done then you are ready to go live so then you're going to click on go live so now you see it says starting in portrait mode the screen orientation cannot be rotated after broadcast has begun so it's going to count one to two to zero when that is done click on the screen and then click play so that your live will start playing immediately so right now this um live stream is on yeah live right now it's on so how do you know that this video is truly live now with this um i'm using a, an android phone to go live now once you go live you cannot exit this screen you have to be on this screen you can't exit it so why this is on now our game is live you can see our game is live now i want us to check i'm going to check with another device to truly see if this game is actually live on this channel so the name of the channel is game zone reloaded now this is the channel now you can see you can see that this channel is live can you see this can you see this now this is the live can you see this this channel is live already so if you click on it you're going to see this channel live so it's loading so now you see can you see this so the channel is live very much live very very much live so you can as well like like the live you can also click here to like like multiple times this is just to make people know that oh this person is live you can you can send likes you can send laughter you can send party and all of that so you, the more you click you know it means you're supporting the live you're just encouraging the owner of that channel here is where you can drop your comments you can say nice this is where you drop your comments this is where you actually drop your comments okay so and this is how to go live using the prison life has this video been helpful to you please if it has do not hesitate to like this video subscribe to this channel and most importantly hit the notification bell so that you can get notified whenever new video comes up so until i come your way again
Bye for now.